Okay, so I know this isn't going to be a typical video, just kind of a quick video sharing my thoughts on uh, the Steven Gostowski uh, situation. So he just got signed by the Tennessee Titans, uh, which is, I think it makes a lot of sense. You know, Tennessee, they really need a kicker. They had a historically bad year kicking-wise. Last year, uh, they missed more field goals than they made. I believe it was 8 for 18. So uh, getting someone who has been one of the better kickers in quite some time, uh, right? you know, to, to join your team... In theory, it makes a lot of sense. But of course, if he was just great, then, you know, you would think New England wouldn't just give up on him, and you'd think that other teams would have gone out and signed him. But it's not that simple. There are a couple of red flags, uh, the biggest of which is that he's coming off of uh, a left hip injury, and, uh, you know, he had to have surgery on it. So uh, there's definitely some very fair and valid concerns to have. It is also worth mentioning on extra points last year, he had 15 attempts and missed four of them. He was just 11 for 15 which is a pretty low percentage, especially considering the extra points. I mean, that's 73.3%. That would be low just in general if that was your overall kicking. So again, kind of a small sample size, but still, I mean, you wanted to have a better kicking percentage than that. However, when it comes to field goals, he was much better. Uh, he went seven for eight, and the only one he missed was a 48-yarder in Miami, which was a game they still won 43-0. to zero. Uh, So definitely uh, not something that he needs to worry about there. So uh, yeah, I think I like this move a lot. There are some risks, but you know what? There's always going to be risk when you get a kicker, no matter what. They're just such a weird position. I uh, might as well you know take a shot on, take a gamble on Gostowski here. It's either him or your undrafted rookie, uh, Tucker McCann. So seems like Gostowski is going to be the guy. Uh, yeah, that's what I think. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Always love hearing from you. And of course, as always, thanks for watching.